السلام عليكم how is all how are you my students today we are going to explain this lesson for you this is the scientific notation as you see on the board the scientific notation for any number to change the number into a product of two factors the first factor must be between 1 and 10 starting from 1 till before 10 as you see here this is absolute a the number beside 10 must be starting from 1 up to 10 till before 10 this is the first question he told you write the following number in its standard form. How can you write on the standard form? Here you have 0 0.75 times 10 power 5. For sure, 0 0.75 is not between 1 and 10 because it's less than 1. So you have to change this number into a number between 1 and 10. How can you do it? You move the point, you move the point till you move the point to the to the right for sure one digit. You put it here between seven and five. So the answer will be zero seven point five. For sure you move the point to the right. And now the motion of the point is opposite to the number line. You know number line? Here, if you put the point in the middle, here, the decimal point, if you move the point to the right, the point is going to be negative steps. And if you move it to the left, the point is going to be positive steps so here you move the point one step to the right so the point is moved by negative step negative one step so you put here 10 bar uh, 5 minus 1 you make minus 1 because you move the point to the right one step to the negative so it will be 10 power 4 so the right answer here, you put here 10 power 4, and you write 0 0.75 times 10 power 4 for sure. This is the answer of the first question. And for sure, you don't need to write the 0 beside 7. So it will be only 7.5 times 10 power 4. What about 73 milliard? What does it mean, the word milliard? For sure, milliard is thousand million. So how many zeros for the milliard? You have nine zeros for the milliard. So it will be 73 times 10 power 9. Times 10 power 9. So... 7 boy, 73 times 10 power 9 for sure is not in the standard form. Because I told you the standard form, the number beside 10 must be from 1 till before 10. And this is 73. So you have to change it to be 7.3. The point is here. Look at this. If you put the point here. So you move it to the left, one digit. It will be here. 7.3. So the right answer is 7. The right answer is 7.3 times 10 power 9. And the point is moved to the left one digit. So you have to make plus 1 here. So the answer, the final answer will be 7.3 times 
times 10 power 10. And this is the standard form. I will repeat it for you again. 73 milliard means 73 times 10 power 9. Here for sure, you, move, you, you have to move the point one digit to the left. So it will be 7.3 times 10 power 9, and you add one to the power. So it will be 7.3 times 10 power 10. And this is the final answer. Now we're going to start to solve the next question, which is number C. He told you 38 and many zeros, as you see. You want to change this number into the standard form. How can you do it? Great. You put a point here, then you move it to the left. How many digits come to count with me? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. For sure, it will be 3.8 times 10 power what? This movement towards left. So it will be positive. So it will be positive nine. So the answer will be 3.8 times 10 power nine. The next question is number D. He told you here, negative three, 2.4, 32.4 times 10 power four. For sure, 32.4, is not between one and 10. How can you do? Excellent, you move the point one digit to the left. Okay, because you move the point to the left, the point is, it, it, it moves one digit to the left, so it moves one positive step. So you make, you make here positive one, the answer will be negative 3.24, times 10 power, and you add one, times 10 power five. And this is the final answer. I think you understand now, how can you change any number into its scientific notation or in its standard form? And this is very important for you in the exam. I wish you understand what I said, and I going, I'm going to uh, solve the next question for you. How can you solve 47 million? How can you solve 47 million? For sure, 47 million, million is six zeros. So it will be 47 times 10 power six. And the point is going to move 
how many digits it must move one digit. So it will be 4.7 times 10 power 7. And this is the final answer. The next one is number G. How can you do it? Excellent, good. You move the point one digit to the left. So you add here one. So it will be 6.8 times 10 power five. 720 times 10 power five, how can you do it? For sure it's not the standard form. So you move the point two digit to the left. It will be 7.20 times 10 power you add here two, it will be seven. And this is the last answer. Now the point is going to move to the right. How many digits for sure? Three, because here zero, 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 you moved three steps to the right and the point moved now negative steps. So you make here negative three, minus three. You make five minus three so it will be negative zero point uh, negative uh, zero negative negative zero 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 three and for sure you have to move one digit more because you must make it three only so you move four digits to the right uh, so you make minus four not minus minus three I will erase this for you. The point is going to move four digits to the right. You make minus four, minus four. So it will be negative three times 10 power one. And one is not important to write it. So it will be negative three times 10. And this is the standard the standard form. He told you arrange the following in ascending order. Ascending, you search for the smallest one. For sure, the smallest one must be 10 to the negative power. And here you have 10 to the negative, the 10 to the power negative one. Here you have 10 to the power negative two. So this is the first one. And this is the second one. You search for the positive powers, and this is the third one because for sure it's uh, negative. What about the positive ones? Here you have positive four, and here you have positive five. So positive five is bigger than positive four, and you search for the smaller, so this will be four, one, and this is the fifth one. And now you order the numbers. I wish you understand what I said today, and I will see you later, inshallah, in the school. Salam alaikum.